In this thrilling conclusion, we're featuring not 4, but 10 more incredibly dangerous creatures. With no further ado, let's dive right into it. First up, it's a small mammal, a nocturnal primate native to Southeast Asia, known for its large, expressive eyes and seemingly cute appearance. Any clue? Meet the slow loris, but don't be fooled. The slow loris has a toxic secret. It's one of the few venomous mammals in the world. It has a toxin-producing gland in its elbow called the brachial gland. It can mix the toxin with its saliva to deliver a venomous bite, as a defense mechanism and a tool for catching prey. The venom can cause painful swelling, and in some cases, anaphylactic shock in humans. This remarkable creature is also known for its slow movements which allow it to move silently through the trees in search of insects and small vertebrates. Sadly, the slow loris is threatened by habitat loss and the illegal pet trade. Next, in number 2, is a highly venomous snake that makes a unique and distinctive sound throughout the Americas. What's your guess? It's the rattlesnake. They are pit vipers and have a unique heat-sensing organ that helps them detect warm-blooded prey. When threatened, they can inflate their body. This makes it appear much larger and difficult for predators to swallow. It gets its name from the iconic rattle at the end of its tail, which it shakes as a warning signal to predators, alerting them to better keep their distance. Their venom contains potent hemotoxins that break down tissue and disrupt blood clotting leading to severe pain, swelling, and sometimes even limb loss or death if left untreated. Although their venom is potent, they are responsible for very few human fatalities. They generally prefer to avoid confrontation and will only strike if they feel threatened, as they often deliver a dry bite as a warning. At number 3, an insect, a hybrid of African and European species. What it might be? Right, it's a bee. The Africanized honeybee is also known as the killer bee. They are more aggressive than their European counterparts and will attack in large numbers when their hive is threatened. Introduced to Brazil in the 1950s to boost honey production, they quickly spread across the Americas, thanks to their aggressive behavior and ability to outcompete native bee species. Their venom is not more potent than that of regular honeybees, but their sheer numbers and relentless pursuit of intruders make them a real danger. A swarm of killer bees can deliver hundreds or even thousands of stings, leading to severe allergic reactions or even death in some cases. Did you know that they are the result of a scientific experiment gone wrong? At number 4, an animal native to South America and it might appear harmless but is one of the most venomous in the world. The Lonomia caterpillar bristles contain a powerful venom that can cause severe hemorrhaging and even death in humans. When touched, the venomous bristles break off and penetrate the skin, injecting the potent toxin. The Lonomia's cryptic coloration allows it to blend in with tree bark, making it difficult to spot and increasing the risk of accidental contact. Symptoms may include severe pain, swelling, bruising at the contact site, and systemic effects like nausea, vomiting, breathing difficulties, and uncontrolled bleeding. In severe cases, the venom can cause kidney failure and even death if left untreated. All of these adaptations help protect them so they can become beautiful adult moths. Number 5, is an animal that can be found in Eastern Australia and has large fangs that can deliver a painful bite. Sydney funnel web spiders are among the most venomous spiders in the world. This large, dark-colored spider gets its name from the funnel-shaped webs it constructs to catch its prey. Their venom contains a neurotoxin called atricotoxin, which can cause muscle spasms, difficulty breathing, and in severe cases, death. Female funnel web spiders are less venomous than males, as their venom lacks a certain component that makes the male's venom so potent. Interestingly, the venom is far more dangerous to humans and other primates than to most other animals. I guess they don't like us that much. Did you know that it has the longest fangs of any spider? At number 6 is one of only two venomous lizards in the world, found primarily in the southwestern United States and Mexico. The Gila monster's venom is delivered through grooves in its lower jaw, which the lizard chews into its victim. This strikingly patterned lizard has a slow, lumbering gait and is known for its powerful bite, used to deliver its venom. Gila monster's venom is a cocktail of toxic proteins and peptides that can cause severe pain, swelling, and weakness in humans. Interestingly, the venom delivery system is quite primitive compared to that of venomous snakes. 
Next up, at number 7, is a highly venomous sea creature that can be found in the waters of the Indo-Pacific. This animal venom is strong enough to kill a human in just a few hours. Banded sea snake is one of the most venomous marine snakes in the world. This snake has a potent venom that can cause paralysis, muscle pain, and even death. However, despite its venomous bite, this snake is not considered aggressive and rarely bites humans unless provoked or mishandled. It is a semi-aquatic snake, spending time both in the water and on land. Unlike most sea snakes, banded sea snakes can tolerate freshwater and are sometimes found in estuaries or even rivers. The banded sea snake is easily recognizable due to its distinct black and white or blue bands that run along the length of its body, as well as its yellow snout and lips. The banded sea snake has a laterally compressed tail, which is an adaptation for swimming. Did you know that banded sea snakes have a fascinating reproductive behavior? They actually lay their eggs on land, and the female coils around them to protect and incubate the eggs. Can you imagine what happens after the eggs hatch? That's right, the young snakes make their way to the sea to begin their aquatic lives. How incredible is that? At number 8, found throughout Europe, a mammal that inhabit grasslands, woodlands, farmlands, and gardens, and their preferred food are earthworms and insects. Can you guess? The European mole can be found across a wide range of habitats in Europe, with the exception of Ireland and some Mediterranean islands. They are particularly common in areas with moist, loamy soil, with strong limbs, which is ideal for digging tunnels and destroy everyone's gardens. One single mole can bring disaster and chaos, like this. Yes, they are venomous. It possesses a venomous saliva, which it uses to paralyze its prey, such as earthworms and insects. This adaptation makes it easier for the mole to consume its meal. Though not dangerous to humans, the European mole's unique adaptation showcases the diversity of strategies that animals use to capture and consume their prey. At number 9, we have an animal that looks like a jellyfish, but it's not a jellyfish. The Portuguese man o' war is a fascinating marine creature composed of numerous individual organisms called zooids, which work together as a single entity, and is often mistaken for a jellyfish. The tentacles contain venomous nematocysts that deliver a painful sting to both its prey and unsuspecting and careless humans. It has a distinctive appearance, with its gas-filled, balloon-like float resembling the Portuguese caravel, which can be blue or violet. Its long, trailing tentacles that can stretch in length are equipped with stinging cells that can deliver a painful sting, causing severe reactions in some individuals. While the sting is usually not deadly, it can cause severe pain, nausea, and allergic reactions in some individuals, so, it must be treated with caution. While not typically fatal, the sting can be extremely painful and should be treated with caution. If you ever encounter a Portuguese man o' war, be sure to keep a safe distance and admire its beauty from afar. Finally, at number 10, we'll have the largest living species of lizard found in the Indonesian islands of Komodo, Rinka, Flores, and Gili Motang. This one is easy, right? Yes! It's the Komodo dragon. As members of the monitor lizard family, Komodo dragons can grow up to an impressive size. Although it was once believed that these giant lizards were only capable of causing infection due to bacteria in their saliva, recent research has revealed that they also produce venom. Komodo dragons are known for their exceptional hunting skills and ability to take down large prey, including deer, pigs, and even water buffalo. Their sharp, serrated teeth and strong jaws enable them to tear flesh effortlessly, while their venomous saliva, containing toxins and anticoagulants, induces rapid blood loss and shock in their prey. They possess a unique combination of strength, speed, and stealth, which makes them formidable predators. They are currently listed as vulnerable, making conservation efforts crucial for the survival of these magnificent creatures. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, and leave a comment below. Thank you for watching.